is it really all over so far as the pool is concerned? Competitive wise, yeah, I'm done. That was my last race, and and this is my last Olympics, and and uh, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm I'm ready for the you know the next chapter in my life. So when your great friend Dara Torres tweets, I'm betting Michael Phelps isn't done with swimming. Anyone care to wager? To which you fired back, yes, I would love to. <laughs> uh, whatever she wants, whatever she wants to bet. <laughs> How would you assess your performance here at London 2012? I finished my career how I wanted to. You know, looking back, I can say I've done everything I've ever wanted to. So I, I don't think that's too bad to, to be able to look back at your career and say <laughs> that. So Let me suggest something to you. The South African Chad Leclerc beat you here in the 200 meter butterfly. Would you rate that as a worst moment? Well, sure. I mean, if I would have liked to win that race, mm. but the hardest worker always wins. You know, the hardest worker, the person who wants it the most wins and he wanted it more than I did. Let's talk about the other swimmers around you. Yannick Agnel, France. Yeah, I mean, it goes on and on, doesn't it? Ryan Lochte. Who do you rate and why? You know, we saw some amazing times in the pool this year. And, and you know, I, I said to Yannick, his 200 free is probably top five greatest swims of all time. It, it, it's going to be cool watching these swimmers grow over the next four years and, 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 and seeing uh, the times that they swim. You know, that's something that, that I'll definitely still, still taste, uh, stay in tune and, and check out what's going on. What do you make of the doping allegations around the, the, the 16 year old Chinese swimmer? It's kind of sad that, you know, people have a great swim and that's the first thing they say. You know, it, um, people who work hard, it shows. And, and um, I, you know, there are people who just jump to that conclusion sometimes and, and it's not right. Being able to watch her was, was pretty amazing. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm happy I actually outsplit her in the last hundred, so. As opposed to Ryan Lochte, of course, who swam slower than her in the last 50. <laughs> I think pretty much every, uh, almost every guy in the final before I am got outsplit by her in the last hundred, so. Uh, yeah, she, she finished very well. Unbelievable. Ryan Lochte says that he will miss you on the blocks. Do you believe him? We like racing each other. You know, Ryan and I bring the best out of one another, and, and uh, it's fun racing him. You know, he's, he's tough. And, and he swims a, a lot of events just like I do. So um, we, we have the chance of getting up and going head to head quite a few times. If it really is all over, and I've got to believe you, because <laughs> you keep telling me it is, what are you going to do next? One of the biggest things is, is you know, being able to work with my foundation uh, more and, 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 and my swim schools and be able to see kids sort of you know, build confidence and, and uh, have goals and have dreams and, and eat healthy and um, you know, make all these decisions that are going to affect their lives forever um, is, is, is something that's really special to me and, and I, I love being around kids, you know, it's, it's a real true smile whenever you're around them and it's just fun. You going to start a family anytime soon? I don't know, I got to find a, got to find a girlfriend first. <laughs> Maybe you'll have time now. <laughs>